Hey guys, welcome to another video, and in this video, I'm really excited. We're going to be unboxing and taking a look at the Netamo Urban Weather Station. And this is just pretty much going to be just a quick unboxing. Uh, stay tuned, I'm going to set this all up. Uh, I may actually include some of that setup uh, footage in this video, or I just may do it on another video. Uh, have to let it run for just a little bit to gather some data and I will do a more in-depth review on this. Now there's been some mixed reviews out there about this urban weather station uh, but it looks like maybe some of the bugs of the early release firmware whatever equipment has been worked out and this is actually a pretty darn nice weather station that you can see what what's going on outside. You know I think the only thing that's really lacking is maybe wind because uh, it doesn't have like a wind speed indicator or anything on it. But So let's take a quick look at the box and see what it uh, shows that you're going to get. And this is the, uh, I want to say it's Netamo. I don't know. I may be butchering the name. But uh, it does have air quality sensors, which is really cool too. Uh, so um, basically, you know, check out your weather. It looks like it's going to give you the temperature. I'm going to flip it over and actually see here. Weather, air quality, CO2, weather and environment, real-time monitoring, indoor, outdoor. Uh, and then let's flip it over and it actually tells you what your uh, environment, weather, outdoor air quality, indoor air quality, the CO2, the humidity, the barometric pressure, acoustic comfort, temperature. And as I mentioned, it does not have the wind speed data, which I kind of wish it did, or maybe uh, an, an accessory, or maybe coming down the road, or maybe it's even out, I didn't see. Um, I can tell you the wind speed and discover weather patterns and air cycle qualities and uh, daily activities. But I believe this actually will keep like a database. So you could actually go back for your location and see some climate data, you know, like high temperature, low temperature, or a certain year, or whatever. And it has an iPhone app and an Android app, and uh, you know you can see if you're traveling what temperatures like back uh, back home. All right, so let's unbox this puppy. And as so you can see right out of the box, we have a nice uh, aluminum-looking sensor here. I don't know if this is the indoor or outdoor, but uh, there is one of the sensors. This one I'm going to gather is probably the outdoor one since it's bigger. It's probably got a lot more sensors in it. Um, so there is a. I'm going to go with maybe the outdoor one. And in the box we have a user's guide. Welcome. A USB cable, mounting screws, batteries included, a little bit of Velcro, and uh, charging. And I think that's it. That is. Put that back. So. That is what you get in the box. And again, I am going to set this up and we will do a review of it and we will see exactly how accurate this is to the best that we can of their abilities. Um, and then, uh, you know, do, do a little thorough review of the data that it's providing and um, how you can take that data and manipulate it into your own little data bank of weather information and analysis and weather forecasting and stuff like that. Uh, taking a quick look at the um, instruction guide here. Not a, not big on words. It's all pictures. Uh, so yeah, if you uh, aren't, aren't good at playing Pictionary or anything like this, then uh, these may not be the instructions for you. But uh, shouldn't be too difficult to set up. There's not a lot to it here. Just communicating with it. Got to download the app and uh, do the setup. And I'll uh, let you know if that's a very difficult setup or not. So, anyway, guys, 
I'm going to close this video out at this point. Um, if you don't see any other footage attached, then this is going to be included in a separate video where I'm actually going to do the setup. Uh, go over the app, go over the data it's producing, and go from there. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and a subscription to the channel. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good one. Thank you.